Trey Wren's path to college golf at Temple was unlike most others. Wren attended the International Junior Golf Academy in Hilton Head, South Carolina before he committed to Temple and started calling the 1912 Golf Club in Plymouth meeting his home. I got a late start. I wasn't really good enough to play college golf until my senior year and I was I was looking around at some schools and I was probably going to go to a Division three school near my house and I, I decided uh, to take a gap year and give myself some more time. Fast forward to present day and Wren isn't just adequate at golf, he's setting Temple records which includes five straight rounds in the 60s. If you're gonna be hot and you're gonna be cold, it's about really just maximizing when you, when you got it going on. I was hitting it well, putting it good, and just shooting good scores. When Wren steps up to his approach shot, he visualizes where he wants to put the ball on the green. He sets his feet, swings back, and connects. Golf's pretty complicated. It, it, you've got a lot of thoughts over your head, so have a nice, concise last thought is what I've been trying to do recently, and it's been working. But yeah, I definitely, I definitely see the shot, picture it, and then step in and hit it. Wren has distinguished himself as one of the top collegiate golfers in the nation, but for him, it does not stop there. The Virginia native is planning on traveling south to Florida and will look to turn pro. Professional golf is, a, is an absolute grind, so you got you to start at the bottom, and only a few people can advance to each level every year, so you got to just be ready to, to do it for three or four or five years and not make any money, and then hopefully it clicks and you can, you can break through and, and be on tour. So that's, that's, the, that's the plan, that's the goal, but we'll see. For ESPNU Campus Connection, I'm Vito Malacari.